What's up everybody, it's RJ with Twin Halos and today I've got five different supplements that I would suggest to myself prior to getting the virus that I should have been taking prior to getting the virus. So before we get into this video, I just want you to understand I'm not going to get into the science behind it. I'm going to link all of the science down below in the description, but I'm not going to go into big medical terms that not everyone can understand. So I just want that to be clear before we get started and I'm just going to use very simple terms so everyone can understand what we're talking about in this video. So supplement number one is going to be zinc and for males specifically it is 10 to 50 milligrams. I've got some notes right here. So this is going to help stop the virus replicating throughout your body. So make sure that you've got your zinc supplement or at least eating zinc filled foods. Of course, it's easier said than done, but that's why supplements exist because if you're not getting it in your diet, then you can supplement to get this into your body. Supplement number two is going to be vitamin C. Now you're going to want to at least get a thousand milligrams a day. Now all we're doing here by taking vitamin C is just helping boost our immune system. That's the biggest thing that we need to focus on is making sure that our immune system is ready to go prior to contracting the virus. Should we come in contact with it, we're ready to go and hopefully you don't experience the way that I've experienced the coronavirus. So the third supplement that I would suggest is melatonin and I would only take this at night because it may make you drowsy. So taking melatonin does help with sleep, but there's other properties that melatonin also has that not a lot of people know. I didn't know this prior to this research, but it has a lot of antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties within it. So not only is it going to help you sleep, but it's also going to help boost your immune system. So if you know how to recover from your workouts, you know how important sleep is. And when you're trying to boost your immune system, you need to recover from contracting a virus, any bacteria, anything like that. So your body needs to sleep and that's why melatonin is a good one because you're going to get the sleep, anti-inflammatory and the antioxidant properties from that supplement. So the fourth supplement is going to be quercetin. Now the reason why this is important is because not only does it have those anti-inflammatory properties and the anti oxidant properties just like melatonin does, but this also inhibits an enzyme that the coronavirus uses to get into healthy cells. So a recommended amount is going to be 500 milligrams per day. So the fifth supplement that I would suggest is going to be vitamin D. Now a lot of us can either go outside if you've got the time to go do get vitamin D or you can supplement it and add this into your supplementation. And what this is going to do is your, imagine your healthy cells are the club and there's a bouncer at the front of the door. What the vitamin D is going to do is be that bouncer and not allow the vitamin, the, not the vitamin, allow the virus to come into the club. You want your healthy cells to be in the club partying without that virus. Now what I've done is all the research that I came across, I've also linked down below in the description. So if you think you want to learn more about each individual supplement that I suggested and how its efficacy against the virus is actually going to be, it's all linked in the description below, along with all the supplements that I recommended also down below in the description. So that's it for me guys. Please continue to stay safe, be proactive, get your supplements in, make sure you're taking care of yourself so that you don't experience getting the virus the way that I did and hopefully you don't have those same experiences like I did when I unfortunately contracted this virus. All right, so take care of yourselves. I'm RJ with Twin Halos, and I'll see you guys in the next one.